The DG Cell Foundation has launched its annual report for the period of April 2020 to March 2021. Foundation Board Chairman Michael Henau said that since the launch of the foundation in October of 2008, it has invested over 139.8 million kina into 533 projects impacting over 900,000 lives across the 89 districts. Henau mentioned that the year 2021 has been a uniquely challenging year for the foundation and for all of humanity. But despite that being so, the foundation has continued to take leaps and bounds in order to ensure that the growth of the communities that it serves continues unabated. And our patron, Mr. Dennis O'Brien, who said that where the business grows, so too must our communities grow. Foundation CEO Serena Sassingan said the foundation is proud of the impact that it has had on the communities as it continues to invest in them. She commended the support of foundation beneficiaries and partners. So I thank all of you for your patience as you worked with us through the last financial year. And I also thank you for pressing on and achieving some of the great results that are captured here in this annual report. Digicel PNG CEO Colin Stone was pleased with the work of the foundation, saying that the achievements illustrated in the annual report is based off of the ethos of patron Dennis O'Brien. Mr. Stone said the achievement stated is over 10% of the country's population that has been impacted by the great work of the current foundation team and those that have gone before them. 690 classrooms, 66 community learning centres, 33 libraries, 13 rural aid posts, 43 mobile health clinics. Those numbers are small, but when you look at the impact that it's had across Papua New Guinea, I think that impact is very large.